yeah, it's a bit boring, so I'm just gonna really skip it and let's get into the scenes where we actually fight uh, um, a, mal a Moltres and hopefully I can give you some tips if you guys haven't caught it I mean this game is so old but just say for example you haven't played it I mean this is the first time I ever caught a Moltres and I've learned a few things about catching Pokemon so I you know I hope to share my uh, experiences with you guys I'm gonna fast forward this because uh, it's not very exciting fighting against these guys since I just as you guys saw, I blew Gary away as he was nothing. I've been raising my Pokemon a lot. I've been spending a lot of time in the game. I'm going to be transferring these Pokemon into the stadium game on the N64, which is one of the reasons why I'm spending so much time raising these Pokemons. Obviously, there is the rare candy cheat, uh, which is very tempting to do. Actually, as you can see right there, is Moltres. So I'm just making my way to Moltres. And hopefully, uh, the next scene after this, you can see me fight it. So there it is. Moltres is there. I'm going to fight it, and the Pokemon I'm going to use actually to fight Moltres is Raichu. Now, when fighting Moltres, you want to Thunder Wave it, uh, paralyze it, whatever you can do to paralyze, make it go to sleep, poison it, do something that's going to affect its movement, so, you know, that's going to affect your overall catch rate when you catch this sort of legendary bird, bird Pokemon. going to go for Growl, so it loses its attack. It's used, again, you know, fighting Moltres is a pain because he uses Fire Spin. Sorry about that. He uses Fire Spin, which is a continuous attack. I used the Thunder Shock on it. As you can see, pretty good damage right there. Yeah, this is what I mean. I mean, it's, it's, it's attack constantly goes on and on. And, uh, you know, these are just really... Uh, this is really annoying. I mean, it, it, it's fine if you you can always change your Pokemon. But as you can see, Moltres is paralyzed, which is fantastic. And that's exactly how I want it. Because it, usually when you use an Ultra Ball, it usually misses a lot. But um, I throw Ultra Ball on my first go. And, uh, and yeah, as you guys can see, I managed to catch it on my very first attempt. Thank you very much for watching. And peace out. And don't forget to paralyze. Alright, so we're inches away of catching Mewtwo, we're very excited, by the way I've got no Master Balls, only Ultra Balls, so it's not going to be easy, so anyway, Mewtwo, how's it going bro, let's go for it. Mew. Oi. It can't speak English, I might you not to die, and so it needs to hit the Thunder Wave, it's used Recover very intelligently. The good news is I don't think he's got many recoveries. I think he's got like 10 of them. Yeah? Well, yeah. that's still a lot. I want to use Articuno. I think Articuno was our best hope of beating it. I mean, it's a very powerful bird. But this, this attack, Psychic, takes so much life. Look at that. He's going with Blizzard. Oh no. You gotta be kidding me. I can't believe it's missing its attacks. Must Come be on, intimidated. Please. Oh, well, definitely it's Mew too. Go for, with um, one again. One, one Blizzard again. I reckon three Blizzards would take its life down all the way to where we want it. The risk you have over Ice Beam. It won't die. That is like that the, was a close one. That was a close call right there. But it doesn't matter as all. Well. One of my favorite Pokemon just died there. So I'm re I'm, I'm thinking getting Blastoise out since he's got such a big life. Right. Let's just chuck some Ultra Balls and see what happens. If you can catch it first go, that would be awesome. Yes, I got the first go! First ball, I swear the amount of people I've seen choking Pokemon Ultra Balls over Ultra Balls, I catch it once! That is freaking awesome! Oh wow, I just caught a Mewtwo man, that is amazing! Whoa! It's so amazing to have something like that in your... Arsenal? Yeah, absolutely! Amazing! No, actually, I don't want to give it any nicknames because I think Mewtwo is a fantastic... 